Who the hell are you? Who I am is on a need to know basis. I need to know. Uh, no, you don't, because I don't exist and we never met. Now, can you shut the door, please? Not to be rude, but it's been one of those days. So produce some credentials or I'm going to put you in handcuffs. Here. I should inform you that's not my real name. My initials are C, I, and A. Catch my drift? Subtle, but yeah, I get it. I'm also going to call your bosses in Foggy Bottom and confirm it. Oh, please do. I'm sure they would love to learn how two moles walked into this space on your watch. Let me guess, they rolled in with flawless ID cards, made a beeline for the scientists for some routine questioning? How'd you know that? CIA. We know all. Why are you really here? This is about the report I sent you guys? I can neither confirm nor deny that. Well, I hope so. Because if S.H.I.E.L.D. has been infiltrated with sleepers post-World War II, we need to root it out right now before it takes hold. Look, all I can say is that you are not crazy. And the people that you have locked up might be the key to proving it. Then come with me. It was fishy when everyone was saying how nice this sharp guy was. I always heard he was a jerk of the highest order. That's not inaccurate. And the lady pretending to be Carter? Worst fake accents you've ever heard. You should tell her that. I'm gonna need some time with him. Alone? With all due respect to your department, not a chance. Look, either do this with me or not at all. Sorry, really. Let me out of here right now. I'm a fan. He really is. We're the good guys, I swear. May I cut in? You again. Told you we're the good guys. Who the hell are you people? I'm Mac. This is Johnson, and that's Colson. We're friendlies. We have the package. All right, then. I suspected they burrowed into S.H.I.E.L.D., but I thought it was the fringes. If someone like Malik is Hydra. They're dug in deep. I'm not sure what's more frustrating, that you won't tell me how you know what you know, or you're telling me I can't act on it. Malik is just a piece of it. If you expose him right now, they'll just go deeper underground. Then I'll follow them there. Hydra took a lot of good people from me. This is a fight I'll wage alone if I have to. I'd give my life for it. What happened to blending in? I just don't understand the functional appeal of those elephant pants. You mean the bell bottoms? Sure. How do people in your time function with all the extra fabric around their feet? I got news for you. This isn't actually our time period. Well, fortunately, there's unfashionable squares in every decade, so you are set. Lately, he's been locked up in his windowless office all day, but uh, I'm in the loop. But enough about my dad, let's talk about us. Maybe you start by telling me your name. Uh, I actually have to get going, so that's... How about you stick around? Maybe we could share some secrets of our own. Sweetheart, who's your new friend? This is Gideon Malik. Gideon, this is... Her fiance. Honey, I think we need to go. <sighs> Excuse us. Wait, you've been here before? A few days ago. 1931. It's a good thing about computers in 1973. No firewalls. I have no idea what that means. What are you looking for? It's a list of targets for insight. These are mostly S.H.I.E.L.D. assets. Wait, Bruce Banner. Never heard of him. That's because he's just a kid now, but in a few decades he becomes an Avenger. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? It's a good thing. So S.H.I.E.L.D. takes hostages now? Anything else you aren't telling me? I'll explain later, let's go. Guessing you don't really carry a piece, do you? Seeing as you got that super serum powers. Yeah, it's not really a super serum thing. 
Seems things just get worse the later in time you go. I think this is my last stop. It's okay, this is just a setback. My software will crack it. Just needs a minute to load. Maybe you need a bigger computer. That thing's too small. What? Yeah. What? What's that? This is a phone. But only old people use it for calls. How did you do that? Check it out. Wow. Wow. Yeah, you look you look okay for a guy who just aged 20 years. <laughs> Looks like I missed a lot. I'm sorry. This is so weird and messed up. But the Chronicoms jumped. We have to dive in after them. Without us, it's... It's way worse. I get it. Just... Wish I could have said some goodbyes. <sighs> Good to see you move. My head... Oh, I can breathe. It feels like there's cement running through my veins. Drugs. I haven't been this messed up since the field hospital. Daisy. That's right. That happened. It happened. Hey, stay with me. What do you mean this happened before? Jay. Huh? Hey, hey, hey. You wanted to hear my story, right? Right, well, it was, uh... Foggy. I can't really remember the hit, but I came to and my leg was a pulpy mess. And I was completely alone. And then Mike Stevens showed up. And the thing about Mike is he was a resolute ass. <laughs> he would never shut up. He was always bullying the new guys. Stole cigs. But that day, he just kept talking to me. Carried me back from the line. Hey, hey, wake up, okay? Stay awake, okay? For the next couple of hours, he stayed with me. When the Germans advanced, when the cold got so bad, I thought we would freeze. He just kept telling me, we are going home. And at some point, I was in a field stretcher, and uh, Mike wasn't. So consider my yapping as a way of passing on the favor. We are going home, Agent Johnson. You hear me? We're going home. But you have got to fight. After all, now, gotcha. Oh, come on. Here we go. Is that you? Hey, what 
you doing up? How long have you been here? Well, I guess, uh, when did you go to sleep? Since then. Did we jump again? I'm not sure. Hey, where are you going? Hey. What are you doing up? Wait, how... How long have you... Well, when did you go to sleep? Since then. Making sure you keep... Resting. I've been looking for you. You should be resting. What are you doing out of that bed? The time loop. Fun, right? That's why I wanted to stay with this team. You ever have a day where something crazy doesn't happen? It's been a while. Reminds me of my SSR days. We just need to get the implant out. And... Wait, it, it's a trap. But we don't know that yet. No, we do. You said somebody obviously went through the drawer and Simmons was supposed to get the scanner, right? Yeah, until I told her I was gonna do it. Every attempt so far has been on Simmons. She's the one they're trying to kill. Maybe, but we still need the scanner. R right, but if I die, I'll just, you know, reset, no problem. If you die, you lose your memories and you have to waste all this time relearning everything. Time we don't have. So, it's fine. Hey, 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 Susan! You have been with us long enough now to know that meals are not taken in a group fashion. Is there some reason you are creating false pretenses under which you might keep me in this location? <laughs> Quick, let's get things started before, well, that. Rory! Hey, what are you doing up? Uh, well, believe it or not, I am stuck in a time loop and I'm running out of ways to save us all. Okay. How can I help? There's no time. There's... <laughs> Actually, I can take a loop. So that wasn't hard for you to swallow? The... the time loop? Nothing seems to phase you. <laughs> it all phases me, just... Maybe not my face. Every time I ask you for help, you say yes. Even if I don't ask, you're waiting here to make sure I rest or whatever. Why? Be honest. Honest? I know your type. My what now? I know people like you. Some of my favorite people are people like you. Focused on the greater good, even at your own expense. You want people to think you like being alone, even though you always end up back with friends. You hate losing. Everyone hates losing. Yeah, but you all keep running into the problem full tilt until you either solve it or slam headlong into a brick wall. Some of those walls were literal. I know. But how does that... Because when people like you run into those walls, you should have someone there to pick you back up. And you... You like to... be that someone? Not for everyone. It helps if they're fun to be around and if they say what they mean and if they have that superpower where they can rock things around, which is very impressive. That's, um... That is 
awfully specific. Mm -hmm. So, what's this problem you're trying to crack? Hey, what are you doing up? Uh, I need you to do something for me. Of course. Well, what do you need? That was nice. Now we need to drop a space robot. Did you understand that? Actually, yes, I did. I'm gonna grab some rest. Uh, the bunks are down that way. Can I take that off your hands? Um, I got it, thanks. Just thought I'd put some weight on the new leg as well. Oh, okay, thank you. <sighs> what? Hey. Hey. Looking spry for an old guy. How's it feeling? Fantastic. I think I'm a fan of the 21st century. It's a long story. But it came to an end. Maybe now is your chance to experience what she was like before that. You should talk to her. No, I shouldn't. She, she can't know who I am. Why not? Because of the timeline. The she timeline can't... is screwed. Pardon my French. And look who you're talking to. A guy who served under I Like Ike and was supposed to be dead by now. Ike? Point is, you got a rare opportunity here. I got a list of people long gone by now I'd, I'd do anything to have one last stolen moment with. Regardless of what space time has to say about it. I don't know. I'll be your chaperone, how about that? You need me to bail you out, I'll be right there. You really are square, aren't you? Harsh, but yes. Hey, I was just coming to... That's different. Going somewhere? Look, I know that you want to help, believe me. I know, but just for once, don't, okay? If you're chasing a lead, you need backup. I have to do this on my own. You know, I learned a long time ago not to let somebody do something stupid on their own. You learned that in the Army. Brooklyn Scout Troop 87. Boy Scouts. You were kind of the bad boys of the Boy Scouts. Have you ever left your post before? Like snuck off the base and, I don't know, played pool and got drunk. You think I'm the kind of person that would do that? And this will be your first time. You coming? Won't we use all the fuel getting out of the atmosphere? Almost. We'll find Z1's location. We'll aim for it. We'll burn the rest of our fuel and float. So it's a hundred thousand mile Hail Mary. As long as you know what you're doing. You have flown this thing before, right? A few times? A time? That's your last chance to stay behind. Without fail. What? You said you've done this zero times. I mean, everyone in S.H.I.E.L.D. has flown a Quinjet. Literally everyone. I heard takeoff is a piece of cake. How are you going to get the hangar doors open without director authorization? This is the only way to bring back Deacon Simmons. By stealing the Quinjet? Abandoning your sister? No. Well, yes, actually, exactly that. If we're gonna beat Sybil, we, we have to be unpredictable. We can't... We can't play by her rules. How's this for unpredictable? Authorization granted. Now, give me that seat before I change my mind. Messed up because he doesn't remember that. 
And why are you smiling? Because yo yo owes me $20. <laughs> what are your intentions? Sure. With Daisy. I don't have any intentions. Well, then you better get some. And quick. Because this thing is coming for you. This thing? <sighs> She's into you. And I'm not even sure if she knows it yet, but pretty soon she'll figure it out. And when she does... <laughs> hey. Thank you. For what? Just being here. There's nothing, but you're welcome. Quake. Sorry, what now? Nothing, just happy to help Quake, whatever you need. Are you being funny? Uh, is it funny? Not if that's what you like to be called, Quake. I, the press called me that. I, I you never... should probably put a Q on your utility belt so people know it's you. <sighs> that's really smart. Yeah. yeah, 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 make fun of the person who can literally turn you to dust. Yeah, you can Quake me. No, I get it. That's why they call you that. I'll be back. Daisy. Yeah. Didn't know I was going to do that. I'm glad you did. It's only right. If the army taught me anything, it's that. They good? They're good. It's beautiful.